Hi everyone, happy Wednesday. My name is Jen and we are on for Ballet Burn for 30 minutes. Great to see you. The thing I love about this class is that it's quick and it gets your whole body moving. Uh, and at the end of it, you can go about the rest of your day, right? Midday, quick, quick work, and then go about the rest of your day knowing that you've done some work, put in some time, and super strong after it. So we will go ahead and get started. Great to see you again. My name is Jen. Hi there, good to see you. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, let's take a quick little warm up here. So open up your feet, heels and toes out, second position, and we'll just take a deep breath in nice and easy. Start to feel your arms lengthen up and exhale. Do that again. Inhale, arms go all the way up. And exhale. And then shift your body weight over to your left. Lean. And then shift your body weight over to your right. Lean. Feel your nice side body stretch. Do that one more time. Shift forward over to your left. And then this time, instead of looking down, look up toward your right arm and open up your chest. Feel even a slight little lift and backward bend as you draw your right arm back a little bit farther. One more breath in. Return to your original position, uh, eyes looking down. And then come through center plie over to your right hand side shift. All right, from this place, again, open up your chest, allow your eyes to look up toward your left fingers, and lift your chest so much it feels like there's just a slight backward bend here. Get long through your arms, find that openness through your chest, and then return to that side body position, lengthen, and then come through center, plie. Extend your arms out. We'll maintain the second position and go plie down. Come through center with your arms. Plie down. Open up your knees, tracking your toes. Plie down. And up. And plie down. And up. This time as you plie, hold. Extend your arms all the way up high toward this ceiling. And then stay right here in your plie. Just shift your body weight to your left, to your right, to your left, to your right. So already feeling a little bit of work in your legs just as you transfer your weight side to side. Nice. Drop your shoulders. Pull your ribs in nice and tight. Hold right here. We rock it right left for four for three, good, upper body nice and still controlled, two, and one, meet in the center, hold, stay low, lift your left heel up, hold, and then straighten out both of your legs, keeping your left heel up, lower your hips down, do it again, lift, go straighten, and lower down, twice more, go lift, Sit, go down. Last time, go lift and lower down. Little pulses next. Go down, down. Yes, staying pretty low, not completely straightening out our legs. And down, and down. Release this right arm down. Peek up underneath your left arm. Eight for seven, for six. Strong arms. Five, nice. Four. Three, two, one. Bring this right arm all the way back up. Lower your left heel down. Pick up your right heel up. Good. From this place, go straighten out your legs and sit. Do it again. Go straighten out your legs. Still these tall arms and sit down, plie. Go straighten out your legs. Plie down. Last time, go straighten out your legs. Plie down. Little pulses, pull your belly in tight. And down, down, good. It's like your arms are holding onto like a, a big egg here, right, an oval shape. And then drop your left arm down, peek underneath your right arm, seven, six, 
five, continue to lift up through your left arm. Three, two, one, return your both arms up. Lower your right heel down, your legs feel a little bit of something. Pick your both heels up and hold right here for four. Keep your strong arms for three. Pull your navel in nice and tight for two, for one. Straighten out your legs, go lengthen. Manage your balance here. Bend your legs, plie, sit. Heels stay lifted. Go lengthen out through your legs. That's right, and sit down. Two more times, fight for your balance, lengthen. Good work, nice. And sit yourself down, pop your heels up a little higher, and lift, go lengthen, and sit down. Stay right here, lower your heels down, lift them back up. Lower your heels down, lift your heels up. Lower your heels down, upright your spine, and lift your heels up. Lower your heels down, lift your heels up. Pulse for me, go down down, down, lift your heels up, stay low, low, that's right, last eight, drop your shoulders, and eight, I noticed my shoulders were piking up, six, five, four more, four, great job, three, two, one, and lower your heels, excellent, let's stand up straight, beautiful, release your arms, and we're transitioning straight into fourth position here, so, Bring your left foot forward and then right foot back behind it with just a little bit of a space in between. And we'll go straight into releve. So that means up onto your toes, you rise. So keep your arms as so, or if you don't like this, hands on your waist is perfect, or you bring your arms all the way up top, you decide. From here, keep your legs long and straight, relax your shoulders down, let's go. Lift your heels up. Lower down, releve, lift. Pull your belly in so there's not too much of a sway in your low back. Stay nice and tall like I'm pulling you up toward the ceiling. Straight up, go lift. Very good, chest up tall. Lift, and I mentioned yesterday, imagine you have a pendant right here in the center of your chest that you wanna show off to the world. You have eight more, go eight, Beautiful, stand tall. Go seven, go six, go five. How you doing? Four more now. Four, long legs, maintain your turnout. Three, good control here, go two, and one. From this place, bend your both legs, and then straighten out your left toes in front of you. Allow your right arm to come forward. So your right leg bent, your left leg straight. Hold right here. Keeping the turnout of both legs, pick up your left leg, lift, and lower. Let's see those pointed toes. Lift, feel a stretch to the top of your foot. Again, go lift, lower. Use your strong legs, lift. Lower, demonstrate control, lift, nice, lower, go lift, lower. Let's see the arch side of your foot even more as you open up, turn out through your legs, your hips. Last eight, eight, continue to bend your right leg, there's no change there, seven, lower down, point your toes, go six, upper body remains intact, Go five, check in with your arms, beautiful. Four, that's the way. Go three, we're adding on one more thing, two, and one, nice. From this place, we straighten everything out, so send your left leg out to your left, and then here we do a little swivel, so take your left knee, take it across your right leg, swivel, open, and extend your leg out to this side. Bend it again. Go swivel to the right, open up to the left, and extend. You have a few more. Go swivel, swivel, extend. And notice you wanna keep the height of your knee. Swivel, 
Swivel, keep the height of your knee and then extend your leg. Four more here. Swivel, swivel, really taxing out this right leg, aren't we? And swivel, swivel, keep strong through your arms. Last two, swivel, swivel, way to go, way to keep that balance intact. One more time, swivel, swivel, and extend lower down, come into first. And just take a really nice little pause here. Even as we feel a little bit tired, our breath remains calm. We stay tall like beautiful ballerinas. Heels and toes out. Let's take a little rest here by moving into gentle plies. So plie down and lengthen. Plie down and lengthen. Plie down. We have four more like this. Nice, easy. Four. Grand plie is next. Three. So we take this plie just a little bit deeper to exactly what it sounds like. And one. Bring your arms all the way up overhead. And then as you open up your arms, sit down. Bend your legs. Open up your knees out wide. And bring yourself back through center. Arms all the way up. Again, grand plie all the way down. Beautiful long arms all the way up. Maintain your long spine all the way down. And all the way up. Think of traction in your spine. Bend your legs. As you come down, you get taller, if you can feel that. And all the way up. Keep your arms up there. Moving into straight up releves here. Go lift, lower, lift. Lower, maintain your turnout. And notice again, if your ribs start to stick out, mine totally do, right? So I need to make sure I take control of that. Really pull my belly in tight. Engage strong through your core. Get taller, longer through your legs. Last eight, go seven. We're moving into the other side next. Six, five, four more, just four, you're doing it, nice work, three, two more, two, and one, great work, release your arms down, and we'll switch over to figure, not figure four, just position, fourth position, with our other leg in front, so earlier we had our left foot in front of right, we'll take our right foot in front of left now, and just you have your heel toe alignment, we start with those releves, you know how to do it, Again, you can choose your arm position. Your arms are here, your hands are on your waist, or your arms are all the way up top, right? Totally your choice. One's not better than the other. It just sort of depends on what you feel like today. So let's, let's go ahead and begin. Get tall, get long. Let's begin. Go lift, lower. Lift. Always you demonstrate control, poise, balance. Go and lift. I always think of uh, ballerinas wearing their point shoes. That stuff really hurts, right? But on the outside, they look so comfortable and graceful. And that's what we're going for here. No matter how difficult or strenuous an exercise is, we maintain our presence, our poise. And that's a part of it too, isn't it? Four. And three. Go two, go one, really nice. Bend both legs. You'll let your left arm come forth with a slight bend and then straighten out your right leg. Keep your left leg bent, your right leg turned out as well and then really maintain that. Really shine your inner thighs toward the front of your space. Keeping your left leg not changing at all, pick up the right, go lift and lower. Just pick up your right leg and lower. I wanna see more arch side of your foot facing up toward the ceiling. Lift, yes, and lower. Beautiful arms. Lift and lower. Go lift and lower. So nice, lift, lower. Your left leg starts to feel a little bit more taxed. That's just fine. It's exactly where you wanna be, eight. Lower down. We have our swivels next. Seven. Lower down. Six. 
six, lower down. Especially when you get tired, tendency is to want to go faster. You exercise control, you got this. And lower down, nice job. Three, can you do even more turnout? Twice more, go two, strong arms here, belly in tight. And one, listen, lengthen out your arms, your leg out to the side, bend your right leg, bend your right knee to face over towards your left so you swivel inward, you swivel outward, and extend your leg long. Do it again, swivel in, swivel out, hike up your knee, extend. You wanna exercise control of your leg, swivel in, out, and extend. All right, usually we're going for something a lot quicker, but this slow movement actually requires so much more control. And if you're like me, you're sweating quite a bit already, and swivel, and extend. Of course, we can't complain, Chicago weather. <laughs> swivel, and extend. Almost there, okay? Go swivel, point your toes even deeper and extend, yes. Last time, go swivel, swivel, and extend. Nice, lower your right foot down and release your arms, good. Let's take advantage of the fact that we're pretty warm, not only from moving, but just from the natural environment that we're in today. Wednesday, Chicago, it's 80 something degrees, right? So, we'll take our port de bra forward. If you would like a bar to help you find your balance, totally use something to help support you. Otherwise, you can certainly do it in the center of the room like I'll be demonstrating here. So, showing you from this side, extend your arms. And then forward fold, right? Simply this port de bras is a forward fold. In a turned out position, this might feel a little bit foreign, it's okay. And let your head drop, extend out through your spine, lengthen out through your spine, good. And as you come back, get long in your spine before you lift yourself up. Let's take a backward bend, lift your chest, and gently arch all the way back. As you come up, open up your arms. You return to where we started. Three more times, so port de bras all the way forward. Feel how long your spine is, how long your legs are. And gently come all the way up. And gently take yourself backward bend. And open up your arms to come out twice more. All the way down, nice, beautiful, long stretch. Lengthen out through your spine and take yourself all the way up. Backward bend, chest up, lift and arch back. To come out, split open your arms. Your final round, relax your shoulders down away from your ears, hinge forward. and gently lift yourself all the way up. Good. Lift up tall through your chest. Gentle backward bend all the way back. Squeeze your butt. And gently split your arms. Release. All right. We've done releve, we've done plie, we've done backward bends. Let's try and tie that all together. So, I'll face you to start. Your left toes will just face directly the screen, right, wherever you are, and then your right toes step it back. So not exactly fourth position. Your left foot is in line with your right heel and your right toes face the top right diagonal. Square off your hips and let's bring our arms all the way up. So on your inhale, come up onto your toes releve. On your exhale, as you lower your arms down, I want you to arch, lift up through your chest. Bring your arms back through center, up onto your toes. Take it all the way back, arch. Again, onto your toes, go lift. Arch back, open. 
Again, up onto your toes. Arch back, lower your heels. Open. I'm gonna show you from the side. Let's do it again. Go lift, spine straight, and lower your heels. Arch. Again. Lift up. Lower your heels, arch back, back. Twice more. Go lift, arch back, lower your heels. Last time. Go lift, lower back, arch. Come up through center, lift. And we'll just transition, release your arms, lower them down. So, right toes in front, left toes face your top left corner, it looks like this from the front, you have your heel, heel alignment. Okay, so let's do it now. Arms go all the way up, beautiful and tall. And take it back, back. I forgot to go on releve. Here we go, up we go, go lift up onto releve, up onto your toes. And take it back, back. Again, up onto your toes, lift. That's it. Take it back. Go back. Up onto your toes. Go lift. Take it back. Go back. Again. Four more. Lift. High up on your toes. Take it back. Go back. Up you go. Go lift. Really think about these upper arms strong. And take it back. Back. They really define your shape. And go up. Take it back. Go back. Take it up. Go up. And take it back. Go back. And gently release. Up you go. Release your arms down and lower your arms down. Let's take a quick shake. Moving into our first position once again. So we did some jumps on yesterday, actually. We did some jumps, we learned the swivel today. And tomorrow when we meet again, we'll put that all together into like a little, little sequence just so that we have a bit of choreography. But today we'll do just a little bit more kind of drill technique work. All right, so keep your arms again in this nice little oval egg shape or your hands on your waist is perfect. From here, bring your right toes up off of the floor, swing them back behind. So the entire time my torso stays still, take your leg back behind. I want to see those pointed toes now. Open. Let's see if you can see your right heel as well. Take it back. So your heel should be visible, unlike this, right? You want to open. Yes. And take it back. Four more. Four, take it back. Go for three, open your chest. Take it back. Twice more. Two, train your balance on this one leg, back your endurance on this one leg. And one, take it back. Nice job, let's switch the legs. So left toes in front, let's see the pointed toes already. And take it back. Point your toes and forward. See the arch side and take it back and go forward. Point your toes back. Open your chest. Go forward and go back. Get four more. Let's go forward. Take it back and three. This really encourages our turnout here. And two, as you swing your leg back, really use your glutes to keep your chest lifted. One tall spine as well. And take it back. And release back into first position. Good. So your single leg stance feels pretty strong. We're gonna continue on then. As you transfer your weight into your left leg, bring again your right leg forward and up off of the floor. Take it up to the side, take it back, and swing it forward. So we're basically taking a ronichon all the way around off of the floor, okay? And then forward, take it out to the side. My toes do not touch the floor. Do it again. Forward, take it out to the side, and back. 
Last time. Take it forward, out to the side, to the back. Close first position. Take it to the back, to the side. Really find your turnout here through center. Go back to the side, through center. Mm-hmm. Go back to the side and bring it forward. Last time. Take it back, out to the side, and forward, lower down. We'll switch the sides and we'll do something else to kind of bring that together. So, left toes forward, just off the floor, out to this side, take it all the way back. Bring through center first. Go forward, out to this side, stay lifted on your sides here so you're not melting into your right side hip. And out to the left, take it back, point your toes everyone, yes. Out to the side, take it back, return to first. Take it to the back, go back, out to this side, to the front, just hovering off the floor, point your toes, back, out to this side, very good, to the front, yes, twice more, back, to the side, to the front, last time, from the back, to the side, ooh, I lost my balance, to the front, and lower down, good work, you shake it loose, do what you need to do, okay, so your next bit is kind of the same thing, You'll lift up off of the floor though. So, coming forward, your right leg goes forward, out to this side. Let's find passe and lower down. So it's just like the half, right? Bring your arms up so your leg doesn't hit it. Go forward, out to this side, passe, lower down, right? So forward, out to this side, passe, Lower down last time, forward, out to the side, pause it, lower back behind you this time. Take it back, go back, out to the side, pause, a little bit harder from the back, huh? And go back, out to the side, pause, twice more, back, out to the side, lift up, pause, fight for your balance each time. Go back, out to the side, Passe, bring it forward again. Nice work, release your arms down. And we'll do some switches of our legs up in the air so we get just a few jumps in. So we're in fifth position now, we'll just switch up in the air so your left foot crosses forward as you land. Let's do a few of those, ready? Go and switch, switch, add your shoulders a little bit mild. Switch, 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 yes. Yes, good work. Four, three, two, one, hold. Nice. Your left leg's in front. All right, arms go in front. Send your left leg forward. Forward out to the left. And find your passe lower down. I'm gonna scoot over a little bit. And forward out to your left, passe lower down, still a little bit over, <laughs> and left, out to the side, passe, lower down, one more time, forward, out to the left, passe, goes back, so we go back, lift out to the side, passe, take it to the back, great job, from the back, stay lifted all the way out to the side, passe, take it back, good work, Back, all the way up to the side, passe. Final round. To the back, out to the side, fight for it, passe. To the front. This is just a finish now. We just switch our legs in our final set of jumps. Ready, go. Switch, 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 switch. Yes, beautiful. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and finish with one more just to get to the other side. Really nice, come back into center, into first position. We've been here before. We just have one more port de bras forward, one more backward bend back, and then we close off our session today together. So heels and toes out, arms through center, lift up tall through your chest, and then hinge at your hips, come forward. By now, maybe this feels a little bit more natural to have that turnout 
in your forward fold. Really lengthen out through your spine. Stick your hips up into the air. And then bring yourself all the way up toward the ceiling. One final backward bend. Lift your chest up. Catch your breath. And gently arch back. And release your arms. Split them. Release your arms all the way down. Thank you everyone for making it out today. Good to see you. Thank you for joining me. These noon classes are super fun. You get a good workout in in a short amount of time. And it's always so great to see you. So good to work out with you. Have a wonderful rest of your day and we're on again tomorrow. So check the schedule and I can't wait to see you again. So Ballet Burn with Jennifer. Look for it on the schedule. Uh, let me know if you wanna see anything else. Okay, have a great day, bye.